Okay, pop quiz. One question, all or nothing. What was the original purpose of the Me Too movement? I'll give you a second. Did you say gender equality? Closing the pay gap? Exposing sexual assault? Well, to be frank, if you said any of those things, you'd actually be wrong. But it's not entirely your fault. The decade-long movement blew up in an instant with a tweet by actress Alyssa Milano last year. She asked women who had been sexually harassed or assaulted to reply with Me Too. From there, those five letters were on the news, social media platforms, award shows, and conversations nationwide. The movement's founder, Tarana Burke, told the Washington Post she was afraid the attention would overshadow the 10 years of work she'd already done, that it would distract from her original goal, which in reality was to help survivors of sexual violence, particularly women of color in low-income communities, find healing. Black Twitter tried to remind everyone what her message was truly about, but it grew into so much more. Issues about pay disparities, power structures, and consent were all placed under the Me Too umbrella. Even Milano eventually acknowledged she found out she didn't start the movement and tried to share Burke's story. But Me Too isn't the only movement that's experienced its original goal taking a hard left from what was actually represented. Like Occupy Wall Street, for example. The movement's theme of we are the 99% was meant to represent the people fighting against income disparity and economic inequality in the U.S. But many questioned what the movement actually accomplished and say the message got lost and what should be done about banks, what the rich need to do, and so on. The common thread through these giant movements that each had their day in the news cycle was their message got lost once the movement blew up. People wanted to help, wanted to join in, wanted to relate. But Burke put it best when she said the millions of women who originally raised their hands to say Me Too were left with their hands still raised. Like the other movements, it left the people that needed help most still waiting for their chance to be heard.